one, go! Qualification match number 50 being started under the backdrop of some emptying stands. 1501 will successfully move across, navigate for their reliance. 4928 doing the exact same thing. Tinley Trailblazers just making it across before Autonomous ends. That leads to a 16-17 Autonomous score. With all of Teleop left to play, everything is still on the table. Penn Robotics understands this best as they quickly grab two cubes in rapid succession and make it easy for another robot to come along, score a couple coin, cones, and complete a couple of circuits. Near me, it's 2909, the Zebrabots, performing a similar strategy as their counterparts on the blue side of the field, playing a utility role, corralling blocks into the shared nodes to get high percentage points. Unfortunately, it does look like Cryofrost is motionless at the moment, leaving us with two active blue robots, our FTAs. Let's thank them, guys. They are working tirelessly to get them back moving. 4926 Galactic using their mechanums to slide across the field, adopting a similar strategy to the zebra bots, their partners, simply corralling blocks into the low nodes. Over on the blue side of the field, unfortunately, it does look like Penn Robotics is also motionless, leaving us two robots down for what's hopefully not the remainder of the match. 1501 picking it up on the far side of the field. Team Thrust, who is ranked three right now, by the way, will successfully score another cone for the Reliance, completing two links at the moment for the Blue Alliance. As we're in endgame, 67-21 is ahead of the game, already successfully engaging and turning themselves sideways so they don't roll off. A very smart strategy. On the blue side, 1501 has elected to continue scoring before finally engaging as the only member of their alliance able to do so. With two one seconds left, Red has completed a double engage. We will see how that alters the final score. 65, 30, I don't think the numbers are gonna stay that way. Stay tuned. Last match of the day, let's take a look at our scores. It's the Blue Alliance winning 77 to 50 and picking up two ranking points along the way.